90 second turn turbo. Is that going to... 85. 85. Is that going to be enough? Eh, we'll see. It's good. It's a good length, I think. I think any less and it gets really stressful and, not, and less fun. Yeah. Let's go get some water. Here we go. <gasps> I'm the Sioux. Sioux. I'm the Swede. Sioux. How do you pronounce this? Sioux. Sioux. Oh, Sioux. A tribe named in the Sioux. desert. A classic desert Swede, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. this is kind of nice. I got some plains. Desert I got plain some buffalo. Swede. Got some cows. I got I'm a cup of tea. Got some rubber. Uh, wait, sweet. God damn it! I specifically validated files today so that I wouldn't have to have Parma Terranova playing, but I still do. Terranova. Time to turn off music again. I have a bit of a problem. I can see Daltos' settler, and it's within two tiles. <laughs> oh <laughs> wow! A good sign. A very good sign. Take One of you's got to have to move. <laughs> what? Do we not have quick movement on? I, I swear, to god, I swear to god, I turned it off. <laughs> Um, yeah, we had two start. I just potato. Potato is dead. Right. <laughs> let's, <laughs> let's try oh, this. Show. We need a bigger map. Let's try this again. Potato. This was a six-player map. There's only five of us. I can't move either. <laughs> no, there's six of us. Like, <laughs> 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 well, twenty-eight point two, oval three point three lek map. Mm hmm Okay. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, the back button is such a stupid thing. <laughs> oh, it does. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, why is that fucking why there? The you go to there? options, you click back, it takes you out of the game. <laughs> You'll get used to it. You know, when you've been hosting Civ games as long as I have, you need to learn one day. You need to... When I die, you're going to have to host these Civ games. When I, <laughs> when I ascend to Nirvana, you're going to be here, left, you know? Duncan in the retirement home hosting Civ games. Can't wait for retirement. It's only a matter of time. The, the apprentice must become the master, Duncan. And it's already happening. Who will succeed me? Simon Clark's going to succeed me. He's going to become the next. Just waiting for William. I'm grooming him to become the next leader of the of this of the cult of the Yogscast. Would <laughs> <laughs> Simon be a tyrant in your stead? Oh, Simon's like an evil me with a goatee. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the Ben and Tom takeover. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they've they've gone very sideways, haven't they? They used to be, like, the real up-and-comers, but now they're just doing their they're gonna, own They're going to step around madness. the Yogscast and take over full floor. That's what they'll do. They're just going to... No, they're just sidestepping all of it and take over, like, YouTube. Oh yes, that's that's the end goal. I could see them take over Twitch. I think they're just gonna just fall into obscurity, <laughs> <laughs> as we are all destined to. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, Aladdin! I the saw club. who I was for about five seconds before it loaded. And the Celts. It loaded so quickly. Well, yeah. No river though. Same thing. Is everyone else loaded? I don't know what my yeah, I'm in. As well. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in. Much worse stuff. God, that was like time. the quickest load screen I've ever fucking seen in my life. What happened? Uh, SSDs, baby. Wow. Yeah. Has really got his new computer? <laughs> yes, I do. Is that why? <laughs> it was oh! quick. It was bottlenecking That's why us all this time. Everything's working so much better. <laughs> it was my fault. <laughs> <laughs> that was, yeah, was expected. I was waiting for like a fucking twenty-minute load screen. Here? This is a. Six player oval map, same as last week. Picking, you're picking the fucking Lekmon maps, and I'm literally right next to it's someone again. It's the same map as last week. Literally next to somebody. Right next to them. Why are you fucking host next time, Stop. man, you piece literally, of shit? Just keep the shittiest maps. This was what we played last week, which is you, you just started the day, you said that was a good map. That Relax, was my child. Fuck. Fuck you! It's a good game. <laughs> ah, it's all fine. Spawn next to somebody. Duncan, we got some cloudy cider in the fridge. It's a lovely sunny day. We're inside playing Go video games. Relax. All is good. <laughs> all is good with the world. Right. I have spawned next to bison. So we have a, a very here. spiritual Guys. animal, I would say. The so bison. Would you? And also calendar. a little bit, a little bit of salt. Mm. A little bit of salt. A little bit of salt. Hmm. We want to go calendar. Cause Where do I that. see what the heck go. my dude does? Mason. You have to go help and then search for who you are. 
I'm Congo. I activate the building queue. Am I crazy? And you have to click on yourself, and then it says what they do. Then Borders you can do expand gigantic history 33% dump. faster. And oh, the Celts. Yeah. And, and then you've got your unique unit. Say again how you get to it. So type in who you are. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's one good thing about Civ 6, you just click on your little icon. It, cause it... It's a slave market. Oh, yeah. You're them. You're them again. It is. Turn one. Oh my god. The slave market. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Not these guys again. Is this another restart? <laughs> I have the Pictish warrior and a silver. <laughs> I think we the should slave probably market. restart this one. <laughs> Just, just don't. Just that. Have it. Just, I'm just going to preemptively say it might be a solid idea. <laughs> we can't do it because someone's going to bring it up later, and we're going to lose the whole vod. We have no, to. No. Okay. No. All right. Can't keep, Can you guys have no fucking like, willpower exist. not to laugh we about just, it? Like <laughs> we just need to not sing songs about it. Is what I'm saying. <laughs> no, really Jesus. Uh, right, restart two. All right. Let's go. There we go. This is a protest. This is a protest restart against that kind of thing. I'm, I'm, I'm we don't need sleep. that yeah. kind of thing in our games. It's just, it's not needed. Okay. Just sing a song about it. What was funny about that? I think that was one of the first games I played with you guys, and uh, <laughs> for the next day or two, I was singing that song. Catchy. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is the run. Oh, oh turkey. Saladin. Timurids. What does Saladin do again? Oh, jeez. Okay, this is kind of nice to start. Okay, yeah. Saladin. What does Saladin I've got do copper do? and coconuts. This needs my city to be named Cococo. Cococo. Saladin. What does it say? Sim. Saladin. Yusuf ibn Ayyub. I get the mad Madrash. Madrasa. Just, it's uh, watching a really interesting video about William Marshall, who was like the most successful times. knight of all time. Well, and they were talking about how he fought Saladin, but they called Saladin a warlord and then just kept moving on. Which I felt was like summing him up kind of bad. Okay. He was more than just a warlord. It's a better university, basically. He wasn't really a warlord. I am Ataturk. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I feel like Saladin is uh, one of those characters you could um, you could dedicate your life to and like start to be a be uh, like a historian on him, you know, and the yeah, stuff he did for sure. Because he, he did a lot of shit, you know. He did a lot of shit during the Third Crusade. Before that, it was mostly uh, governing Egypt. So but afterwards, it was dying. Uh, Chat so, says Saladin was a pretty cool dude, but also a pretty not cool dude. Yes, <laughs> a lot of people were like that. Honestly, <laughs> it's history. Cool Welcome dude. to history. Yeah, <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, he was not a cool dude because that's the reason why I love the guy is because he literally was a cool dude. For surely, he killed quite a lot of people, right? Yeah, he did, but it was war. Yeah. Only when they deserved it. <laughs> Freed slaves. He actually bought slaves to free them. He funded women and children and orphans. He allowed Christians to worship in Jerusalem. Wait, after he, he bought slaves to free them. Doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> fake news. All right, end up, end your turn, Duncan. Let's, 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 let's play the game. The game of Civ. All right. Civilization. I don't really know anything about Saladin. Oh man, I can talk about him for a little bit. <laughs> I can talk about it for at least a minute or two. <laughs> the only thing I know about him is from like video games I've played, like Age of Empires. That's yeah. It. Or um, isn't he in an Assassin's Creed? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think Pops so. Up one. Him and there's Richard a, there's a um, very popular uh, Swedish uh, series of books about that takes place during the Crusade, where Saladin is a major ca a major character. I haven't actually read them, but I think a lot of Swedish people have um, come in contact with them there. Mm. Man, this is an interesting. I would say that during his time, he was uh, Dr. Bashir played him King of the Heaven. He was probably more of a scourge to other Muslims than like the West. Hmm. He fucked up people out there, man. <laughs> was that kind of his job? I, as far as I know, yeah, he was just... basically, a, you know, he was dealing with a crisis, and sometimes, you know, you got to break some eggs. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, how are you going to get an omelet? 
It was a right. foreign foreign invader to the caliphate, basically. Him and his family. Hmm. That's useful. Oh, he, he was an invader? Like, he came in and took over? Oh, I have a They're favorite. Turkish. Yeah. He came, it was like Alpaslan Turks. Yeah. Wait, Saladin was Turkish? Yeah. I had no idea. There's so much history. Well, yeah, it was Kurdish. Yeah, Kurdish. Ah, Kurd yeah. It was a very long time ago. Yes. In the 1100s, you know. My favorite story about him is there is an asshole named Renaud de Chatillon who kept raiding caravans. And now, Sal he's in Assassin's Creed. He is in Assassin's Creed. He's a big dick in that, too. Yeah. Uh, and Saladin was like, if you keep doing that, I'm personally going to cut you in half. And Renaud was like, yeah, fuck off. And then he caught the guy and cut him in half. It was pretty Very funny. nice. <laughs> that, like, never <laughs> happened. Funny. Pe people just don't meet like that. Bong. Bong. Okay, I'm gonna put one here. It gives me obsidian and races. I got a free population from a ruin. Oh, Ooh. nice. Kill him, he's in the lead. <laughs> <laughs> Giga Lions versus Potato. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know how to play this game. I will say this one thing I really like about Civ is the sound effects are really satisfying. Like the start of the turn, oh, you yeah. Go, mm. and then. Yeah, I, I think I it's, it's all more. built around the addictive nature of just one more turn. Like the whole sound design and game design, it's wild. Yeah. You always want to do like one, just get to that next one or get to that next play thing. Goddamn crack cocaine. Love it. Damn. Okay, as we're going to go for this, I think. How early do you guys start building another settler? Oh, like the second thing you build, third, I fourth. Get my monument usually. Yeah, I, I usually get like scout, monument, worker, settler. No, I just I get monument from. So I want the worker early free. because otherwise I feel like I don't do anything to improve my city while the settler builds. I usually go two scouts because I really like finding tribal villages. Yeah, I buy the second scout usually. Hmm, how much does it cost? Hundred ten. Oof. It's just a hundred for me. I'll buy one too. Hundred bucks. I'll read it. I could have, could have maybe bought the worker instead, but whatever. Oh. Chat complains about my hissing mic because that's my fan, and now I have to turn off my fan. So this is a sacrifice I'm making. It's Do you really use Streamlabs OBS? Yes. yes. Oh, never mind. It's probably Discord for it's them. It's anyway, Discord. So it yeah. yeah, yeah. I was going to say, there's a really good um, noise reduction uh, thing in Streamlabs of ES I've, I've found, which, which is, I can show you later. But yeah, I, they'll hear it on Discord anyway, so it's fine. Doesn't Did you matter. know you don't need a stream deck? You can just, like... Use hotkeys? Use hotkeys? <laughs> yeah. uh, that blew my fucking mind. Like, uh, Bree had to save me from buying it. Yeah, okay. well, the, a lot of people uh, sing the praises of stream decks. Like, it's so cool, I just press a button, do the things. Like... Yeah, but I can do it too. I can also just press shift five and get it sorted, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's useful. I agree. It's, it's like. It's, it's useful free. because you don't have to press your keyboard, mm. I suppose. But on the other hand, is it that huge difference? Like pressing keyboard and versus now, pressing a separate well, button? It's, it's, nice, it's nice to have, XLR. like, because if you have a lot of different hotkeys and it has, you know, you get like a little icon for each one so you can remember them easier. I guess. Yeah, it, it's. It's a it's a luxury lazy <laughs> yeah. thing if you have yeah absolutely it, it's it's not bad but I do in in no way think it's needed you can still do a bunch of cool shit just like from Spes said it is just the lazy man's thing yeah like the green screen they sell you could just buy for six bucks like a sheet of it and <laughs> yeah and yeah but it is nice how they just have it like a thing where you can stand it up behind you you don't what need to like this? slap Coco something Coco. and so on I found Coco Coco that's me Coco Coco because co copper and coconuts oh so smart and also Co bison. Oh, that's not mm. work. Smart business. Co bison. Oh, I found that goodie hunt. The president of America. America. <laughs> <laughs> I'm quite upset that, that you stole my goodie hunt. How dare you? To be <laughs> fair, I was there first. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my unit is stronger, so I have, you know, right of power. Well, if it helps, it gave me map knowledge, so it wasn't exactly uh, a useful one. Yeah. <laughs> you can have it. <laughs> Ew, math knowledge. Ew. No. It's like, it was like, hey, we will tell you about this barbarian who lives. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't really give a shit, but thank you. We'll tell you about your own impending doom. Mm. Mm. All right. Time to remember to swap back from production.
Otherwise, you do the same thing. Like, okay, building a settler. Just set it all to focus on production. Yeah. And then you leave it there for 100 turns. <laughs> the key is to have only one production on every tile. That helps. Oh. I'm going to be that guy and mention the Great Library. I am going to be full of thinking about it. it. I, I am 100% beelining it because okay. I got a really nice spawn for it. I've already Now, said is he anyway. bluffing? Or oh. is he serious? I'm actually being serious this time. I am mm. uh, I am beelining it because I thought it would be good. I remember well, the meta when we used to play Civ 5 was just skip it because someone was going to beat you to it. Yep, that is a, always a solid meta. I'll let you know right now, Spiff. I'm building it and it's 13 turns away. <laughs> I'll let you know, Potato. I think you're a big, fat, filthy liar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. He's not filthy. Uh, now it's exciting. Everyone keep an eye out for notifications at around turn 25. Ooh. Having my city to build it, but... Oh, I met you, Duncan, somehow. Hello! Where are oh, you? you? Oh, you were gonna get the goodie hop before I did. You bastard. What? What kind of accent is that? I'm gonna get a goodie hop of what I need. <laughs> oh, oh God, 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 God. Goodie hot over here, though. I, I wanted to that get. goodie hot. No, you know of me. I don't know. Where are you? You there south. Was a good there. You down here somewhere. Okay, mm. not that. I mean, you're pretty far away. If I can't see you yet. That's good. Happy with that. Liberty, honor, piety. Piety. I read through the change log a little bit on Legmod. Like they they buffed piety last patch. I'll go piety. Hmm. Yeah. They buff piety. I go piety every run. It's now great. it's even better. Piety. Even... Adopting piety. How did they plus buff one culture, it? Plus one faith well, I mean, in the it, cat. It, it would be the same we played last last week, obviously. Okay. So it would be the same one you played with. But the issue is, I I can see a change from when I last played it. I oh. think I think it's mostly a couple of the pantheons and stuff, uh, and. Uh, a couple of the religion bonuses no, give higher I bonuses. I've, I think I've spotted it. It yeah. is a free garden in your first four cities. Oh, that's that nice. is pretty nice. That's nice. So does that mean your cities don't have to be built on water? Whatever the normal requirement is. No bloody idea. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there a normally a requirement for a garden? Um, no flowers. Garden, oh. Three people points. What about garden people? must be built next to a city must be built next to a river or lake for a garden. Yeah, yeah so fresh water. So you can just build your cities anywhere. What's the other advantage of fresh water? Is there one? I uh, guess uh, yeah, water um, mills and wheels with water rivers. Wheels. Water wheels oh, yeah. and also uh, early on farms get a bonus from being next to fresh water. Oh, yeah. Later yeah, in yeah. the tech tree, you get the same bonus for non-water as well. But yeah, it's kind of why like desert floodplains are pretty wild um, mm. if you can build a farm on them. I found so many goodie huts, it's absurd. Really? <clears throat> I haven't found many at all. I got like, I'm on like number seven, I yeah, think. Yeah, I got like four or five. Ooh. Found Mount Fuji. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> this is near me. Is it? Yeah. Where are you? And I'm playing Spain. Oh! It's fun, yeah. So I get double resources from it. Oh if I can my pick it up. god! My god! Ba, ba, ba. Goddess of the fields. Ooh. Bonuses yeah, yeah, for good. incense and tea, baby. Let's go. Ooh. Cotton as well, and something else. Coffee. Yeah, well, we don't speak of that last one. Oh. <laughs> Magical bean juice. Bleh. Bleh. Mm. Oh, I've discovered the Barringer Crater. I also realized I'm also getting a perpetually looped Terra Nova. <laughs> yeah, why is that? I hate it. Terra. Terra. Nova. Oh, oh. That's very yeah, I, f I miscounted the amount of moves. I thought I'd be able to move and then place the city. I could not. This is a problem. Um, this is a rather serious problem. Oh, if I was this Doubtos, you have the Behringer Crater. I do have the Behringer Crater. You, you scared the hell out of me when you said that you saw it. If you I, save my, my settler next. potato, I will owe you huge. And so if I, if the Barbarian's obviously going to kill your settler, but if yeah. I kill the Barb, can I return it to you? 
Is that return as a settler or a oh, worker? How does it work? Curious. We'll you find out, I guess. Okay, you are quite <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. I miscalculated badly. Rip. <laughs> Rip. See, poop, see. Well, I'll be able to kill the barb next turn, so. Okay. Where's my goddamn warrior? I sent him an auto explorer. This Jeez, is a bad idea. Barb's a spawning like crazy. Come home, bar warrior. Come home. Okay, I'm going to return the unit. Good luck with okay. you. I hope the settler. See what happens. <gasps> oh my god, you saved me! I thought I no. owe you. I owe you badly. <laughs> Alright, right click, declare war, kill the settler. <laughs> <laughs> Too late! <laughs> you settled very close to me. I'm okay with it. This is as far as I'll go. This is the edge. Right.